So here's the number, here's the 200. This is the 200 that isn't smashed to bits by a container on its way to Dubai. So this is the pre stuff. This Phil fiddling with a bit of something. Luckily, we don't really have to do any acting in this bit because <laughs> we just drive down the road. Which, considering, considering we're all sort of half falling asleep now, is probably best, I think. We don't need to bother with lines or anything. Nothing we're not, we're not wired up, yes. are we? There's nobody talking, nothing. No. We're just sitting in the seats. Just suits. sitting. You're looking at your thing. You're just reading a paper. You're listening to your music. How are you feeling at this late hour, Michelle? I'm feeling okay, actually. Very you're looking, relaxed. you're looking, you're looking bright-eyed. I am. How are you, in general, with a night shoot? I prefer night shoots. Does it agree with you? It does. Are you I'm, a night creature? I am a night owl. Right, right. Early mornings, not so good. Okay. I'm a quiet, very quiet. That's lucky because on this shoot, it's just about all it's night all shoots. It's all about night shoots, so yeah. I'm going to be happy. Oh, our seats just hours. broken loose. Yes. <laughs> I didn't do it. I don't think it was me. We're at unit base uh, for one, getting ready for one more night shoot. Uh, it's our last day out and about before we head into the studios, and we've got half an hour to wait. So I'm here with Adam James, hello, playing, playing McClellan. <laughs> there or, he is. Or Stevie thought. <laughs> Stevie thought I was Di Di McMillan. McMillan. Yeah. Di, yes, Di McMillan. Di McMillan. Di Di McMillan. Yeah. My name was Di McMillan. That's Di McMillan. Detective <laughs> Inspector. Yeah. <laughs> Because we've been mates for what, 10 years? Good 10 years now. Yeah, yeah, we met at the Royal Exchange Theatre, Manchester. We play brothers. Half brothers. How people cannot see the, the, the resemblance. The filial resemblance. Not it's me. brilliant. It's uncanny. And you have another Doctor Who connection. There is a Doctor Who connection. Yeah, go on. Well, I had no idea prior to any of this that uh, David was actually a genuine Whovian, Whovian fan. Oh, yeah. Uh, I then happened to impart to him the knowledge that uh, one of my godfathers was John Pertwee. John Pertwee's godson. Have you seen he's got a doctor scarf on? What do you mean? Yeah. Oh, I see. Well, it's not. Oh, right, yeah. Oh, yeah, he's the matron. Oh, look at that. 